Hi, Paul back at the iCafe studio and for this video I want to show you how to create a meeting in your desktop Outlook. Hopefully you've got desktop Outlook installed on your computer and the, the icon pinned to the taskbar so it's easy for you to access. If you don't have that done yet, visit the iCafe studio to help for a little help with that video. Let's take a look at my computer. I'm going to open up, click on my little icon down here and you're going to see my email open up into my inbox. In order to do a meeting invitation, I'm going to come down to the bottom left. You can see there's a little calendar icon there, or it may say calendar, and I click to open up my calendar. This is showing my personal Outlook calendar. To create um, a meeting or an appointment, which we'll look at the two on the top here, there are two separate things, and, and I'll discuss them a little bit. A new appointment is what you would use when you want to add something strictly to your calendar. Okay? Nobody else is invited, you just need a reminder for yourself. A new meeting is what you're going to use if you want to invite somebody else into your meeting to discuss whatever you need to. So I'm going to click on New Meeting, and it's going to open a little wizard for me. The first field is the To field. Who do I want to invite to this meeting? So I'm going to invite Jennifer Mitchell. Okay. Then I have a subject. Try to be as specific as you can. Uh, I'm going to put iPad Idea for Reading. And then Location, I'm going to put my room number, A4 and then I have my t dates and time. It defaults to the current day that you're on. If I want to go next Tuesday, I just click on the 16th. And then my times, if I click the drop down, will go half hour increments. But I am able to click in here, like if my conference time is from 11.15, starts at 11.15, I'm going to put 11.15 in there. Once I hit enter, you're going to notice here that my time did change and now it's at 11.45 for a new increment. Clicking the drop down, I can go and say I want to do it for an hour, and I'm good to go with that section. The bottom part here is where you can make a special note to whoever you're inviting to let them maybe know a little more detail. Have a great idea for iPads and retail. Would love to discuss with you. And I hit send. As you can see on my invitation here, and when I go to the right week, that there is my iPad idea for reading assignment. Jennifer, whoever you send to, will receive an email asking you to asking them if they can join the meeting or not, and they will say yes or no, and you'll get a notification back to let them know if that's going to work. It's that simple. This is Paul from the iCafe Studio. Have a great day.